Hello, as you can see, I am not in my usual habitat. I am dog sitting this guy back here. His name is Finn, he's a Sharpay, and he might make an appearance of stinky breath. So this is Finn. All right, now he's getting creepy. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> oh, oh. So I haven't done a Lemon Likes in a while, and looking back at some of the old ones, they kind of came across a little more scripted than I wanted them to. I want this to be more of a casual, open place where I just tell you some things that I like. I think I'm going to go for this more random approach. So this video is going to be some random things I like for October. The first thing I want to talk about is this book that I listened to on Audible called Girl Boss by Sofia Amoruso. She's the founder and CEO of Nasty Gal, which is a clothing line. The book is about how she got to where she is today. She's a businesswoman and she owns her own company. I really liked her story and the book has like an honest tone and she refers to the reader as a girl boss and she even has portraits of other girl bosses throughout the book. The book has so many good words of advice and good quotes in the beginning of each chapter and I really like that it's not fluffy. When it comes to like motivation and words of advice, I like it when it's straightforward and honest. I found myself relating to this one part in the book where she calls it the sad bunny phase and it's where she would wear a mom robe and it was fluffy like a bunny and she would just throw that on and even forget to shower and it was just in a phase where she was growing her business and it was all by herself and just things took a back seat such as showering. She was just growing her business on her own and she was so focused. I have done that in design school where I was trying to finish a project and I've even done it with sea lemon stuff where just everything takes a back seat when you're so focused and in the zone of finishing something that you're so into. She just goes into funny details like that and even talks about her addiction to chai tea lattes, which I can definitely relate to. I recommend this book if you ever wanna be your own boss someday or if you're working on your own project. It doesn't even have to be a business that you're working on, just something of your own because it goes into how you can find success but staying true to your own style. If you're interested in listening to this book or any audiobook, Audible has a deal where you can get your first book for free along with a free month of membership. And that's what I did when I got this book. If you want to take advantage of that offer, just go to audible.com slash sea lemon. Speaking of chai tea lattes and other lattes, the next thing that I really like is this milk frother. This is very random, I know, but I have never had one of these and it has completely changed my drinks. There are a lot of different milk frothers out there. This one was really cheap and I'll put where I got it in the description below. I originally got it for my matcha lattes because the powder is really hard to mix just with stirring and I started using it on my other tea drinks and coffee drinks and it just makes things taste a lot better because it mixes them so well and it gives a little foam on the top and it just makes me feel like it's from a coffee house. If you have an espresso machine, you might already have one of these but I do not and this thing is really awesome if you are addicted to coffee and tea drinks like me. The next thing I want to mention, if you guys didn't already know, is that I'm on Tumblr and I have it at clemon.co and one thing that I really wanted to show you guys is that I love the photos that you share with me so much and I wanted a place where I could just see them all and if you go to this link right here, it's I labeled it lemon love because it's all of the love that you guys put out there when you hashtag see lemon. So if you share photos with me, you just might see yours on there as well. That's Finn running. <laughs> um, so you can see it at clemon.co on Tumblr. And I hope you guys liked this video. It's a little more random and casual. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new here to see my DIY videos and possibly more lemon likes. Just thinking. This is a deep moment. <laughs>